Okay, good day everyone. Second activity, it's all about the variable. It's a storage locations and associated symbolic name which contains some known or unknown quantity or information of a value. So, ang variables uh, ginagamit for um, specific numbers or maybe it could be equivalent or representations of each uh, codes. So, we have three variables. We have the integer, the float, and the character. So, when we say integer or also known as int, or short term po niya or short word is int, gagamitin po natin yun sa ating um, programming language, all programming language. Int stands for number. Ayan. Single number na or whole number. Okay. Then, the float stands for float also. Representation niya is for decimal. Ayan. Or maybe, ang float could be double. Okay? Ayan. Ayan. And then, the character, or also known as string, pwede siyang gamitin as string, or... Pero lagi po talagang ginagamit is car or char. Ika ng iba. So, ang gamit ng car is for letters. Okay? Ayan. So, let's start. Ayan. Dito sa prog uh, programming uh, language of C++, we have sharp include, which is the main. Sharp include, I stream. And then, using name, using name, space, std, and then in main, open close parenthesis, and then open close bracket. So, int means we present a number or a whole number. So, we use the variable name of A, and then B, and then C. Okay, nasa sa inyo naman, pwedeng num1, or could be num1, num2, num3. It's up to you na pag mag-name kayo ng mga variable name. Okay? And then, we have the C out. So, enter two integers to add and then spacing of name and then semicolon and then C in then sem and then we have also B for semicolon and then C is equals to A plus B And then, C out. Double quote. The sum of the numbers. So double quote again. First, so. So, C stands for the sum. Yes, C. And then, N. Semicolon. And then, return, semicolon. Ayan. So, U, A, stands for the first let or the first number. And then, B is equal to stand for the second number. So, C means the sum. So, let's start to execute. So, run. Yes. So, bawa sum. So, save. Okay, so to add a number, 5 plus 5 is equals to the sum of number 10. Get it, guys? Ayan. So, yung A stands for A, uh, A stands for 5, and then B stands for 5 also. So, yung C is the operator or the operations of sum. Okay, or another. 
So, execute again. And then, compile. Let's see. Um, 13 plus 12. So, the sum is 25. Ayan. Oh, let's start with the double. Try natin si float or the double. So, float. Kung kaya niya bang mag-compile. So, let's start with 12. Oh, 1.2 plus 2.1. So, 3.3 ang lalabas. Okay? So, yan yung gagawin natin for the next activity. So, ngayon, ang gusto kong ipagawa is for multiplication, division, and subtraction. So, wala na kayo kung isa-isa yung gagawin or sama-sama po silang lahat dyan. It's okay lang sa akin. And then, that will be your activity for today. Okay? So, that's it. And thank you.